Good evening. In this video, I'm going to deal with addition of time. On the whiteboard, I've got two separate operations. One which does not deal with renaming, and one which does deal with renaming. Now, when we're dealing with addition of time, we treat our minutes as one whole separate sum, and then we treat our hours as one whole separate sum. Now, sometimes, when you add up your minutes, your total will be too big. Then we're going to have to convert into hours and minutes. Now we know that there's 60 minutes in one hour, so if the total in our minutes column is 60 or over, then we're going to have to rename. This pink chart here is a very handy aid for students. It shows that there's 60 minutes in one hour, 120 minutes in two hours, 180 minutes in three hours, etc. And with practice, the children will start to learn these off by heart and find converting to hours and minutes much easier. So let's start with our minutes as a separate sum. 7 plus 1 is 8, and 2 plus 3 is 5. That's our minute sum done. We move over to our, our hours. 3 plus 4 is 7. So our answer to question A is 7 hours, 58 minutes. We didn't have to rename our minutes because they're less than 60. Let's move on to question B. We look at our minutes column as a whole to start, and then we'll move on to our hours column as a whole again. Okay, 6 plus 5 is 11, plus 7 is 18. Drop your 8, bring 1. 5 plus 4 is 9, plus four, 5 is 14, plus 1 is 15. That's our minutes side done. We know we're going to have to come back and rename this because it's greater than 60 minutes. Let's move over to our hours. 4 plus 3 is 7, plus 2 is 9. Now, as I said, we're going to have to rename this because there's 60 or more minutes in the minutes column. If we use our pink chart as an aid, we've got 158 minutes in our minutes column. We can see here that 158 is less than 180, but greater than 120. So it's going to be in between them. So that means there's two hours in the 158. Two hours or 120 minutes. Okay, so to rename, use the same clear, concise language that we use in standard subtraction. We take away our 2 hours, or 120 minutes, from the minutes column. So, 158, take 120, leave 38, bring 2 hours. So we've taken our 120 minutes and converted it to 2 hours here on the hour side. 9 plus 2 is 11. Now if we look at our total minutes, they're less than 60 minutes, so we don't have to rename again. So our answer is 11 hours and 38 minutes.